Hey guys, it's your favorite auntie. Well, Deion Sanders, also known as Pop Pop Prime, is the new name he's um, been given since he's going to be a grandpa. He has finally spoken about his daughter's pregnancy. So let's get into this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. So everything in this video is alleged. It is in my opinion and is for entertainment purposes only. So unless you um, live under a rock or you drink a lot of water and just mind your own business, um, but most of us don't, then you have heard the news of DeAndra Sanders uh, now being pregnant by Jacques, who is an R&B singer. He was um, known for... He, um, <laughs> I'm going to be nice. So he likes to do a lot of remixes by other artists, but that's not what this video is about. We're not about to get into Jacquees and him always singing someone else's song. But he has also been known because he had a very public relationship with the rapper Dreezy, who, by the way, I think is a very talented artist. And so recently they all made headlines um, because I feel that, you know, it's probably quite unfair, but there was some back and forth between Deion Sanders' daughter. Let me, we know her name is Deandra. Let me, I'm gonna call her Deandra, not just Deion Sanders' daughter. But so Deandra and Dreezy went back and forth on social media where, um, Dreezy basically called out Deandra and let her know that, Hey, your man is still messaging me, still trying to get back with me. He doesn't want you. He really wants me. You know, of course, Deandra responds, pipe down. You're still sending pictures, underwear, something to the house, I guess, trying to insinuate that really you're the one stalking her man. It was quite embarrassing. Deandra is 34 years old. And I just think that at that age, you just can't be going back and forth with somebody's, your man's ex. If it's got to be all that, then you got to really reevaluate the situation. Well, I the part that I think is unfair is the fact that Dreezy decided to out Deandra and say that, you know, you're pregnant. And I just thought that was a little unfair because of the fact that, you know, she should have been able to tell her own story about her pregnancy, or we should have been able to see it in pictures because you know how we do. Um, but yeah, so she told the story for her about her being pregnant. And she also, of course, released all these messages saying, no, look, your man really does want me. He said he don't want you. And we know the messages had to be recent because in the messages, Jacquees says that just because she's having a baby doesn't mean that, you know, essentially he has to stay with her. Dreezy is the one he wants. So then DeAndre had to acknowledge that. She had to acknowledge that, you know what? I'm playing the part of a fool. And I, she acted as if she was going to walk away. But I knew that she was not going to do that because, you know, she, if you're having a child, that's a very difficult thing to do to just say in the middle of your pregnancy that I'm just going to leave this guy. So I was surprised that she took him back so soon. I thought, you know, you know, some time would pass before she did that. But nevertheless, she took him back really soon. Complete embarrassment um, for her. I really felt, I, I, I felt two ways about the situation. One way I felt like, you know what, you're too old for this. Um, on, on the other hand, I kind of sympathize with the fact that she's in a vulnerable position right now. So the point of this video is because Deion Sanders has spoken out about um, his daughter being pregnant, and I wanted to play his response to all the news of being a grandpa. So let me play this clip. I don't like that, though. Why not? No, but he's, Why not? I, no, we should embrace it. I like it because I, I love my daughter. First yes. of all, I'm, I'm proud. That she, yes. wait, she's 34. She'll be 34 momentarily. Okay. So I'm happy it's, that she, yeah. she's ready and she's prepared and it's a blessing. Yes. But I don't know if I'm ready to be a granddad. You grandpa have, Prime. Yes. Grandpa Prime. Grandpa Prime. Grandpa Prime. What do you guys think about that name, Grandpa Prime? I thought it was kind of funny. And it's fitting for him. And he know he's going to eat that up. He is going to love on this baby like this baby has never been loved before. We got, we got something for Grandpa Come on. Prime. Grandpa Prime. Grandpa Prime. I understand you your favorite book. This is my the favorite book besides book. the Bible. I already know y'all judging right there. The Bible. Deion Sanders. Y'all let him finish. 
That's my favorite book. The Little Engine That Could. Oh, my uh, God. And we got a little Today Show, uh, a third hour Today four. Show. Y'all ain't, no good. Y'all ain't no good. Look you know that's right. Onesie. That's not you right. Be, yeah. Oh, yeah. There, there you go. Pop, 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 prime. Pop, pop, prime. Pop, pop, prime. You ain't right now. Deion Sanders. Pop, pop, prime. Pop, pop, prime in the flesh. Thank you. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. I can see the T-shirt now. You're about to become a grandpa. So what do you guys think? It seems like he's excited about the fact that his daughter is having a baby. He was proud of the fact that she's 34 and now having the child. And it seems as if he's saying that she's well equipped. I'm going to assume he means mentally, financially to carry this child. And um, so he seems to be on board with it. I don't know how he feels about Jacquees personally. He probably would have picked someone else to be the father of his um grandbaby but i could be wrong in that he could very much have a great relationship with them something tells me probably not but hey he just got to roll with the cards as they're dealt right so i don't know i um i don't see this relationship probably with jacques and deandra lasting i think she's probably most certainly going to end up as a single mom but she has the support of her family, I'm sure. She definitely has the financial support that from her family and I'm sure from, you know, whatever she does to be able to take care of this child. I, I My concern is the text messages between him and Dreezy tells me everything I need to know that this is what she's going to be dealing with um, as long as she's dating him and nothing's going to change. But I get right now why she's sticking beside him she does not want to go through this pregnancy alone. I'm sure this is an embarrassing time for her and she'd rather have him by her side. This time next year, we probably won't even see him around, but that's just my thought and opinion about that. But like I said, I don't know that to be true. He could be this great guy, but the evidence is showing us that I don't think so. So what do you guys think about Prime, uh, Coach Prime and uh, him uh, seemingly excited about the fact that his daughter is getting ready to be a single mom. You know, that's, that's my thought. That's auntie's thought about that. You guys drop it down in the comments, what your thoughts are about this. And please, please support the channel simply just by liking the video. And if you're not a subscriber, consider subscribing to the channel. Talk to you guys on the next one. I don't like that, though. Why not? <laughs> no, but he's, Why not? I, no, you should I, I like it because I, I love my daughter. First yes. of all, I'm, I'm proud she yes. wait, she's 34 she'll be 34 momentarily okay. so i'm happy it's, that she, yeah. she's ready and she's prepared and it's a blessing yes but i don't know if i'm ready to be a granddad grandpa prime yes. grandpa prime